Hi, this is Robert Tube. Today on the Hunter Call of the Wild is a very special day. Now, the reason it's very special is because of this animal I've just found. Now, since the Hunger Savannah came out, I've been after one of these. And the very funny thing is, I hunted with a friend in multiplayer. It was his first game, right? And he joined my lobby on this map. And the first thing he said to me was, and if you're watching, Bisha, you'll know what I mean. He said, is this white animal rare? I goes, what white animal? And he shot it. And it was one of these. It was an albino wildebeest. And I've never seen one myself until today. So what's that? Three and a half, about four years. The Hunger Savannah's been out. And this is the first time I've ever actually seen one myself. So here it goes. We're using the 308. Should be an easy shot. But it's just so nice to get one. But yeah, I'm grinding the Hunger Savannah for an albino female lion. That's what I'm hoping to get because I've already got a male albino lion and I want to make a multi-mount with both of them together. Um, I've been after that for probably about the same amount of time since the Hunger Savannah's come out. But uh, I've still not got it yet. So in between grinding for moose, which is going well on them, uh, New England mountains, I'm breaking it up by coming to the Hunger Savannah and hunting lion. So a bit of lion hunting then a bit of moose hunting just to keep it fresh, you know what I mean? And uh, hoping to get something nice. Uh, I do love the Hunger Savannah. If you haven't done the storyline as well here, I think it's actually one of the best storylines. Along with Medved, uh, I think those two are the best. But I really enjoyed the story here at the Hunger Savannah. So I do like hunting it. It's a lot of fun. And it's not it's not really sweaty hunting. It's just casual fun hunting at the Hunger Savannah. And I think that's why a lot of people do like it. Some of the reserves are a bit harder to hunt than others. And often the ones that are a bit more casual are normally the firm favourites for most of the community. So, where's our albino wildebeest? Now, where are we going to put him? Where shall I put him? I'm not sure at the moment. I was thinking about in my albino room in Sasuke Safari Trophy Lodge, but for today, I might just put him in Spring Creek Manor. I'm sort of working on getting Spring Creek Manor up to the same sort of level as my Sasuke Safari Trophy Lodge, which is nearly full, and it's all diamonds and rares, or super rares, or great ones. Um, but I'm, I'm working on Spring Creek Manor at the minute. I have been for quite a while, but I only put in diamonds, rares, or super rares, or goes in uh, great ones in my lodges. I'm quite strict about what I put in there, but so obviously it takes time to add another trophy because once you get to a certain level of trophies, you, you know, I mean, you, you can only get like super rares or great ones, so they are obviously takes quite a bit of time to get. But it's nice when you get something like this, which I haven't had at all, and it takes many years. Uh, to finally get it and stick it in your trophy lodge. I think once I've got an albino lion and we get the great one moose, um, I think I'll probably go after black bear great one again. I'm feeling like I really fancy going back to Silver Ridge Peaks and start that back up again. I got to about 1,100 kills last time, didn't get a great one, and I was sort of getting a bit... Grind it out, I should say, because black bear grinding is quite hard, really, compared to most of the other um, great one grinds. So I had a little break. So now I'm sort of refreshed and I'm getting ready to go back and try and get one. And hopefully we do get one. Um, well, I'll just stick at it till I do, basically. That's normally what I do. So here we are at Spring Creek Manor. As you can see, we're greeted by two great one red deers in the foyer. I've been working in this sort of lobby area. On the trophies, they're all diamonds or rares in here for about six months to like put a lot of these in recently. And then up here, as you can see, they're all nearly full. But this room needs a bit of work. We've got a diamond wolf here I shot ages ago. I can't remember where I actually shot that. But um, this is where we'll put the albino wildebeest for today. Till I decide where I'm actually going to put him. But um, yeah, I'm enjoying myself. I've been having a lot of fun. I've been swapping it up a lot recently, as you've seen. I've been jumping in between games. I just play what I enjoy. And I think that's good for your sanity. <laughs> Sometimes just grinding uh, all day long at one thing isn't fun. So I, I try and have fun now and uh, just enjoy myself playing. But if you want to see any content, whether it's guides, whether it's for the Hunter Classic, Hunter Call of Wild, Call of Wild Angler, have been doing a lot on that. Check out the recent videos and that's really coming on with the recent updates. Or if it's Wade Hunter, just drop it in the comments and I'll just see what's popular and I'll go out and try and make you that content. So today we've got an albino wildebeest. 
I'm Ronald Cube. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please subscribe to YouTube channels and thanks for watching. Bye bye.